My name's uh, Robert Williamson. I'm one of the otolaryngologists here at Texas Children's and otologist, so I kind of specialize in the ear aspect of our, of our specialty. This was a five-year-old who's had a progressive hearing loss over several years. Was initially treated with hearing aids, and as time has gone on, her hearing has deteriorated to the point that the hearing aids are no longer useful to her. Went ahead with uh, placing a cochlear implant in her right ear. It went very smoothly overall. The cochlea, the inner ear anatomy, was, was normal. There weren't any real um, unusual aspects to that, so we didn't have any, any challenges at all. Uh, the device was um, placed completely into the cochlea, so all the electrodes went into position, which is good, what we want. We got good responses back from the device and also from her auditory nerve on the testing and so uh, the surgery went very smoothly as, as, as well as we could hope for. This was a relatively straightforward procedure that she's like I said she had normal inner ear anatomy so uh, sometimes there's bone growth in the inner ear or the inner ear didn't develop properly and that adds another level of difficulty but we didn't encounter any of those things today. She'll spend the night here in the hospital with us and get some additional IV antibiotics and uh, pain medication to keep her comfortable. And then we'll go home uh, probably tomorrow morning. The hearing should be much, much better, much more uh, natural and useful to her than what she's been getting from the hearing aids.